What's up investors and welcome back to Easy Stock Investing. In today's video, we're going to be taking a look at the public portfolio, okay? And what I'm trying to do here is I'm trying to be as interactive as possible with my viewers, okay? And I couldn't think of a better way to do this than to invest some money but let you guys pick the stocks that I invest in or at least come to terms with me on the stocks we invest in. You give me some suggestions, I will do the due diligence and we'll decide whether or not we're willing to invest in the companies that you guys recommend. And I'm gonna say in most cases, I am going to invest in the companies you recommend. But first and foremost, I wanna apologize for the vertical video. Unfortunately, when I'm capturing these videos involving the public portfolio, the public app is the only thing that I can use. So I have to do these videos on my cell phone. Unfortunately, public doesn't have a web browser you can actually use yet. Hopefully that's coming in the future and I'll be able to use the computer to shoot these videos. So I just wanted to get that out of the way first and foremost, I apologize for the vertical video. Now, as I said before, guys, in this series of videos, I want to be as interactive as possible with my viewers, okay? And basically what I did here is I deposited $1,000 into this public account and I'm gonna put $50 a week in here and we're gonna invest that money and we're gonna watch it grow together we're going to make profitable decisions together, and that's how this is going to roll. So one of the first investment recommendations I got was Shiba, Shiba Inu currency, okay? And I did. I went ahead and I put $100 into Shiba, okay? And that's as far as I'm willing to go because this is kind of a YOLO play, okay? And I don't mind having a couple of those in my portfolio, I just don't want to dedicate a large percentage of my portfolio portfolio to any type of YOLO play whatsoever. And you can see right now, out of the $100 we put in, we currently have $75.67. Okay, we're down $24.33 on this Shiba investment already. 24.33%, okay? That's how much we're down on Shiba right now. So yes, this is a YOLO play. We'll hold it in our portfolio. We're not going to add any more to Shiba at this moment or foreseeably in the future. But yeah, let's have this one sit here. Let's see what happens with it. And we'll just kind of check back with this one in three to five years, I think. So the next thing I did in this portfolio, and this was not recommended by any viewer. This was just my own personal investment that I needed to make to start this portfolio off. And I went ahead and I purchased some VOO, okay? The Vanguard S&P 500 ETF. And the reason I did this is because I think that an ETF like this is a very important portion of someone's portfolio. And in my opinion, you should dedicate a certain percentage of your portfolio to something stable like the S&P 500, okay? You need that stability, especially since a lot of stocks that I have a feeling we're going to be investing in in this portfolio are going to have very, very high volatility. So I need that sense of stability, okay? And what we did is we went ahead and we invested $300 out of that $1,000 initially invested into the S&P 500, okay? So 30% of our initial investment went to the S&P 500. I felt that that should give me enough stability to basically counteract some of the volatility that's going to happen in the rest of this portfolio. We are currently down a dollar and 31 cents on that investment in the S&P 500. Our total holdings currently sit at $298.69. So that's where we're at in the public portfolio as of right now. We currently have a cash balance of $704.24. So that is money that is not invested at this point in time. Now, I do like a lot of prices in the market right now, okay? Some of these high growth stocks have been getting hit over the last month. So if I don't get more suggestions pretty soon, I am going to have to start making some investments on my own, which may be okay with you guys. I would just love to hear your thoughts and opinions and I would love to try to invest in stocks that you guys recommend to me. But 
if I don't get any of those recommendations, I feel that I'm going to have to purchase fairly soon, okay? Especially with the way prices are sitting right now. Anyways, guys, that's going to be the end of today's update on the public portfolio. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and help me out with that YouTube algorithm. It really does help. And if you're new around here and you want to get notified every time I upload a video, if you want to follow this account every time I upload a video about it, all you have to do is hit that red subscribe button and join the family of investors. If you want to take advantage of some free stocks from Robinhood or Weeble, those links will always be in the description below. And remember guys, let me know down in the comments below, what do you guys think I should be investing in? We're going to put $50 a week into this account and we want to watch it grow together. And we can't do that if the money is just sitting on the sidelines. So help me out guys. Let me know what you think. What are your thoughts and opinions? What are some good stocks to invest in? Anyways, guys, I will catch all of you on the next video. Have a very beautiful day. Peace.